Major League Baseball just issued the longest suspension in the six plus years in which the league has had a domestic violence policy. But the question is, should accusations be enough to suspend an athlete? What's up, everybody, and welcome back to The Fumble. I'm Jackie Ray or Jackie Ray TV if you want to follow me on Instagram or Twitter. But before you do that, please make sure you hit that subscribe button and that notification bell. And then in the comments below, let me know if you feel like accusations with no physical evidence is enough to end an athlete's career or at the very least drastically impact it because it seems like a lot of people feel like evidence is not necessary and are applauding Major League Baseball for taking drastic action against Trevor Bauer. Now, if you don't know, Bauer joined the Dodgers last season and was placed on administrative leave with pay on July 2nd after domestic violence allegations surfaced. Now, according to court filings, a woman claims she initiated contact with Bauer and began a consensual relationship in April of 2021, with some agreed upon rough sex, but that led to sexual acts that were not consensual. She also said she was choked with her hair until she lost consciousness. But after that, she still went back for more, but established a safe word in case things got too rough. But not only was she choked again until she lost consciousness, she began to convulse and said she was punched. But Bauer has posted several texts to his Twitter that shows the woman continue to text him, wish him happy birthday, and send nude photos well after the alleged incident. He also says that the woman and her attorney contacted him in October of 2021, wanting money to settle the issue and keep things silent from MLB. Bauer refused to be extorted, and then the Washington Post released a story. Fast forward to the league deciding to suspend Bauer for two years for violating their domestic violence policy. Since then, two other women have come forward with similar claims. Does this sound familiar? It's the Deshaun Watson case playing out all over again. But instead of most people on Twitter having this moment where they see this blueprint of big paydays being laid out, they think the NFL should issue a similar punishment. LA Dagwood said, we suggest NFL commission suspend Deshaun Watson for the same amount of time as MLB suspended Trevor Bauer. Watson should be expelled from the NFL. But many for some reason say there must be at least minimum punishment for as many accusation Watson has against him, it's getting off easy. This user says the NFL doesn't care about sexual assault. While this user says Trevor Bauer is a weirdo and I'm not defending him, but I do have some question about how and why the MLB came to this conclusion. I wonder if this precedent will impact Deshaun Watson. But the question for me is, can I just throw out some allegations with no physical evidence to get a little paid? Wait, can I do that? No, probably not now that I said it on video. I will never fall on the side where I think words with no evidence are enough and the court of public opinion gets to decide someone's fate. But it's going to be interesting to see if this two-year suspension causes the NFL to at least update their policy. How do you think this will play out? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Once again, I'm Jackie Ray and thanks for watching The Fumble.